The difference between hard water and soft water is that hard water has a high mineral content. Also, it'll run your pockets, listens to Slayer, and has a teardrop tattoo. Hard water gets its high mineral content passing through deposits of limestone, gypsum, or chalk. And drinking hard water can actually have some moderate health benefits. Like the United States National Research Council has found that hard water can serve as a dietary supplement for calcium and magnesium. But an issue with hard water is that it can mess up equipment and impede water flow. Sometimes you can see grody looking calcium deposits at the end of hard water taps. Check out this portion of an ancient Roman aqueduct in Germany. It was in use for about 180 years and had 8 inch thick mineral deposits along some of its walls. Soft water on the other hand has low mineral content with low levels of calcium and magnesium. Also it won't stand up for itself for any reason, regularly cries itself to sleep, and obsesses over that thing that you forgot you said to it. Interestingly, when you feel all slippery after taking a shower, that's soft water that you're using. The high mineral content in hard water makes the soap lather up less. So you end up washing the soap away faster and feel more cleanerly. Growing up in Utah, I always felt a little bit icky and less clean whenever I took a shower while on vacation. But you aren't actually any less clean using soft water. That slippery feeling associated with soft water is actually your skin being more hydrated. Maybe most importantly of all is that hard water just tastes better, in my opinion. And in fact, but also in my opinion. <laughs>